Where's Frostra and Thundercall at? I told him we'd be meeting at noon. Hold I on, can't right really remember them. They're so relevant at this point, I forgot they existed. Bro, have y'all seen how crazy Pride Keeper is? It needs to be nerfed. Nerfed? Ha! <laughs> it sucks. It needs so much more for it to actually be good. Pride Keeper is the best weapon in the game. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes. Y'all missed me or what? Mm. Nobody missed your stanky ass. Bro, you're just mad you got a nerve so much that my grandma beats you. Yo, how about you shut up before I whoop you? I'd like to see you try. Wait, wait, guys, 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 guys. Stop, 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 stop. Ooh. Hold up. I think we need to actually figure out what the best attunement in Deep Woken in order to settle this. Today, guys, I will be finding what the best attunement in Deep Woken is. All attunements are good when used by the right player, but only one attunement can truly be the best. In order to find what the best attunement is, we need to base it off these four things. Damage, talents, mobility, and for the final one, update protected. Now, you might be wondering what I mean by update protected, and this simply means how much an attunement gets nerfed in the weeklies, slash how balanced does it stay over time. Without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Flame Charm. Flame Charm is an attunement that revolves around burning and exploding opponents, causing massive visual effects that obscure the view majorly. Flame Charm relies on its high damaging moves and combos, along with its crazy movement to jump around enemies quickly. Flame Charm has some of the most high damaging mantra combos in the game, giving it A tier for damage. The amount of flame talents that exist in Deep Woken far outweighs the rest of the attunements except for one, making it an extremely diverse attunement. Flame Charm isn't known for its mobility, but it sure isn't discredited for it, having Flame Assault, Flame Leap, Dancing Steps, Talent Tree, and Warding Radiance. As everyone knows, the buff flame and nerf gale meme that exists in Deep Woken is indeed true, as Flame Charm has only received one significant nerf that I can remember in the past couple of months, in which was a nerf to Flaming Scourge Cancelling, Flash Fire Sweep, and the major nerf to Flame Wisp that completely changed how it works. Overall, Flame Charm is a very strong attunement. Gale Gale Breath is known for many things, including its track starring ability, its combo potential, and its PvE damage. The damage on Gale is definitely solid, having mantras such as Astral Wind, Twister Kicks, Rising Wind, and Champion's Whirl Throw. Gale has the best combo potential on Deep Woken, as the classic combo of uppercutting into Rising Wind can put your opponent in the air with no ability to fight back. The talents of Gale are definitely solid as well, with it having the Suffocate Path and the Spectre Path. Both of these paths are equally as good, with both having talent trees and abilities. The movement on Gale is like no other, having Gale Lunge, Wind Step, Gale Leap, Wind Passage, Astral Wind Stop Fall Damage, Air Pressure, Gale Wisp, Inhale, and much more. The only bad part about Gale is the fact that it gets nerfed almost every update, yet it still stands strong somehow. Gale at its peak was feared by all and was practically unbeatable. Thundercall is an attunement that revolves around stunning your opponent or applying surge stacks to them. Thundercall is a good combo attunement, yet is still run of the mill. With Thunder being my favorite attunement, it has my favorite mantra in the game, Thunder Kick. The talents on Thunder are alright, with the normal path revolving around stunning your opponent and having electrifying talents, while the surge path revolves around putting stacks of surge on your opponent that will do extra damage over time. Stun is better for combos, while surge is better for damage. The mobility on Thundercall is not the greatest, with the only movement for Thunder being Lightning Cloak and Rising Thunder. Thundercall rarely ever gets nerfed or buffed, which is not bad or good for the attunement. Thunder is most definitely an average attunement. Iron Sing Iron Sing is an attunement that has a main goal of stripping you of your armor, making you susceptible to lots of incoming damage, and taking away the main portion of your physical and elemental armor. The damage on Iron Sing is like no other, having mantras such as Call Trops, being able to take a bar if used on the right build. The talents on Iron Sing are unfathomable, with there being more talents than Flame Charm has. Iron Sing is an extremely complex attunement, with even its mobility being pretty good. The main mobility for Iron Sing is Metal Ball, Metal Fake Out for catching people, and Needle Barrage for getting up in the air. 
Iron Sing has been severely nerfed in the past, but nothing has stopped this attunement from climbing up the mountain of best attunements. Shadow. Shadowcast is notoriously known for blurring your screen and making it impossible to see moves. Shadowcast paired with Vision Shaper Realm is very deadly, making it unbearable to fight opponents using this attunement. The damage on Shadowcast is insane, having mantras such as Rising Shadow, Shadow Gun, Shadow Assault Blast Spark variant, and Eclipse Kick. The talents on Shadow are decent, with two and pretty important talents being Fear and Sightless Still, with one hanging your enemy in place and the other blurring your opponents of vision. The mobility on Shadow is decent as well, with its main mobility coming from Encircle and Shadow Assault. It has similar mobility to Iron Sing in the sense that it is really good for chasing, but pretty bad for track starring. Shadow rarely ever gets nerfed, and even if it does, it still stands strong after the nerf. Overall amazing attunement. Frost Draw. Ice is an attunement that has definitely fallen off over time, and has yet to come back from the glory it once had. Ice has very high damaging mantras, making it a top pick for PvP and PvE. Mantras such as Ice Daggers, Rising Frost, Ice Grab, and Ice Lance are some of the best mantras Ice has. The talents are pretty average, with one talent path focusing on freezing opponents, and the other path focusing on placing crystals that explode on your opponent. The mobility on Ice is carried by Ice Gate, with it being the only mobility mantra other than Ice Lance that Ice has. Ice is like thunder in the way that it doesn't really get nerfed or buffed very often. This attunement can be extremely powerful when paired with another attunement, but on it its own, it stands to just be mediocre. Now that we've gone over every attunement, I find Shadowcast to be the most powerful out of the six. The damage and combos that can happen on Shadow are just too good to be ignored. The way Shadow blurs your screen and hides its animations and moves is really insane for landing its crazy combos. Shadowcast paired with tools such as Gravity Bell and Vision Shaper make the attunement even stronger than it already is. I mean, the attunement literally has Crit Blade, one of the strongest legendary weapons in the game along with Fire Keeper. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe as it makes me happy and leave your feedback slash comments below. See you guys. Alright, but ready? Uh, no, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> Get out of here! Frostra and Thunder call that. I told him we'd be meeting at noon. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, no, don't laugh. Don't laugh. Shut up. <laughs> Say it. I can't believe you remember them. They're so irrelevant at this point. I forgot they existed. <laughs> Dang it. Say it again. Just say it again. I can't believe you remember them. <laughs> Stop <laughs> laughing, Nate. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Nerfed. <laughs> <It sucks>. <laughs> <laughs> Restart. <laughs> it sucks. It needs so much more for this. <laughs> 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 it both took a strut. <laughs> Not serious, bro. <laughs> both took a strut. <laughs> he felt so strongly about it. It sucks. It needs so much more. Yeah, it's <laughs> he can't do that struggle, bro. If he does that struggle, he does not get cry. Oh. Exactly, bro. He can't. I can't. The chuckle actually oh make him want to laugh too. Man, you gotta nurse so so much that my. <laughs> 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 bro. All right, just start over again. Just start over again. <laughs>